Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Ibrahim Mustafa and it is always a pleasure to welcome you and have you watch my videos. Thank you for supporting me and my channel. I appreciate. Today we are going to talk about KDP publishing strategies for success perhaps in 2023. But then what is KDP publishing? Is that the process of you uploading and publishing your own books? on amazon so maybe you have low content no content kind of books what fictional books non-fictional books and you upload them on your uh, kdp accounts and it, the books appear on amazon.com which is one of the biggest platforms for marketing and sales and you get people to buy your books and you also make some extra amount of money so it's painful that in the past two years, people complain to me because I do videos uh, that they don't have sales, they've been doing all strategies, but they are not making any money, there's no income. Yes, it's frustrating because you put a lot of energy and nothing to show off. So today I'm going to share with you some strategies that may help you to get back into the game and to publish more and make some income. Number one is learn to do your own keyword research. This is very important. People will not tell you this, but some people, because they want to take it uh, KDP as a business, they want to literally pay for everything. So they pay people to get keywords for one book, and you are not publishing one book. You are publishing a lot of books, and uh, you don't need to waste money like that if you are not making the money. So learn to use um, uh, Amazon key uh, research bar to do your research. You can use the Amazon search bar to do your uh, keyword research and you get good keywords. If you do the KDP suggestion expander, Google Chrome, you can get more keywords from Amazon alone. And you can use other platforms for free. So learn to take charge of your keywords. Number two, is that you need to learn to create your own covers. I don't know how much I can stress on this because I had a uh, guy who I mentored to publish Amazon, before he met me, he was buying literally on Fiverr, $10 per, per, per book cover, $5, $10, $15, and he was spending a lot of money buying covers, people to design covers for him, and he was not making money immediately from Amazon. So he was uh, stressed, he was frustrated because he spent over $500 doing covers alone. Because the strategy is not to publish one book. The strategy is to publish different, different books in different niches. So if you are doing publishing, and the important part of like uh, low content publishing is your covers. Because people use your covers. If your covers are good, you rely on your covers and uh, just go on with that. So you need to learn to do your own uh, research in terms of creating your own covers and you can use Canva to do your covers. Don't waste a lot of time. You do st use Canva, just do the one page cover if you don't know how to do the, the double page. And once you upload it, you go to Canva Create and Canva, use the Canva cover creator to supplement the back page. So do your own covers and I do my own covers. Number three is that you need to learn to promote your books organically. You need to learn to promote your books organically. Take charge of your marketing. Yes, it's not entirely true that Amazon will just market your books, all your books for you. They will start marketing your books when you start making sales. That is important. When you start making organic sales, Amazon will then index your keywords well and start marketing your books for you. But before that, you need to learn how to market your book. Take, cha take charge of your books. So perhaps if you publish a book, share it on your Facebook, share it on your Instagram, share the book on your Twitter if you have any. If you don't have all, create a Pinterest account and start sharing your books on your Pinterest account manually. Start doing that. So start marketing your book. Take charge of your book. You can also do YouTube and promote your books under you can equally, if you have a blog post, blog, start sharing your books there on your blog. 
and with all these strategies you are good to go you can start making some income maybe if you are even on linkedin you can contact people who may need your book and they will buy so take learn to promote your book organically because if you start paying money you if you don't understand the game amazon ads will spend all your money and you will be frustrated and that's why you come out and you are insulting everybody if it's a scam you are telling people that oh it's frustrated amazon you are not making any sales but there are people still making sales with amazon.com okay the p publishing on amazon so learn to do your own promotion and once something works for you you keep on doing more of it if instagram is working for you focus on instagram if twitter is working for you focus on that if youtube is good for you go for it don't listen to me now say because of pinterest go and do more i make more money on pinterest selling books and my affiliate links you may make more money selling uh, uh, books promoting your books on not pinterest but twitter so learn to use what works for you and go for it but then learn to promote your book organically the other one is that you publish in multiple niches one niche may not get you anywhere but if you are publishing in multiple niches niches perhaps they are seasonal some niches are seasonal so if you have seasonal niches like christmas q4 niches and you are just sitting down nothing will happen in january february nothing happens but if you publish in multiple niches maybe perhaps you have coloring book niches which are like based on uh, niches that you can publish on maybe christmas if you have niches that you can publish on maybe easter niches you can have holiday niches with a Mo mother's day father's day books june uh, like juneteenth all these holidays halloween and stuff so you need to diversify more niches coloring books games puzzles these are all different niches that you can target and also look at seasonal christmas q4 all these type of niches will help and also look at businesses because the business niches they keep on selling all the time and also gift niches so publish in dif different niches learn publish in different niches and keep going it's going to be possible but then you need to up your game and learn to publish in different niches to make some impact and uh, other thing is that you need to diversify your income streams i cannot em overemphasize this I used to publish only on Amazon, KDP, and uh, I wasn't making enough money. One book will sell, two, three will sell, four. But I was worn out because I've put in a lot of content, pushing a lot of like strategies. But then things at the beginning were not working for me. So I was learned to diversify my income stream. So if I do my own cover page, I'll do my own interior. And I'll publish the interior on different platforms. So I sell my interior on Gumroad. I publish it. I do KDP on Amazon. I sell some of the interiors on Etsy.com. And uh, it keeps on moving. So the strategies keeps on moving. And I also do videos to share even my, uh, some interiors to get free leads. So I share free interiors to get leads. If you check my uh, some of the videos, you see some of the interiors I've given away for free, niches I've given away for free, just to be able to get leads. And I convert them and also do online courses for KDP, even though I don't market it enough these days on my YouTube, but I used to have that and I make money from that. So if you go to my Gumro store, I have close to 200 products, niches, interiors, different, different things on my Gumroad store. So if I publish on KDP, I publish on my Gumroad store, I publish on Etsy, and I just keep on doing the same thing. So that diversify your income streams. Don't only rely on KDP Amazon. Find different ways that you can also equally. If you do a cover, if you do an interior, where you can sell it to. And that can help you too. So let's go to the thing. The final one is subscribe for KDP interiors. Don't buy. So if you are a Nino, you will see KDP interiors on a, a Creative Fabrica. That's the best place to get KDP interiors. I've worked my heart out you know, in the KDP industry. I can tell you the best place to get 
multiple KDP in two years is sub, uh, Creative Fabrica. When you go to Creative Fabrica, you see different interiors. Some like $2, $1, $3, $4, $13. You no, know, endless. Don't buy one. Do the sub monthly subscription. And the monthly subscription, now they are even discounted. You can get a monthly subscription for $9, for $7. They, they've discounted it. Even for $79 a year, you can get a subscription like that. So do the subscription. And once you do the subscription, you can download over 120 something KDP interiors for free on Creative Fabrica. And that will help you. So don't buy one. Just subscribe. Do the subscription, yearly subscription or monthly subscription, and you can get them literally for free. All the products that you can download, all the fonts, all the KDP interiors, you can get them if you have the yearly subscription. But if you are paying for one or two or three, you are still going to spend a lot of money. And that's the strategy I used to do. Until then, I also started creating my own interior. So you can buy. And the secret of even subscription, subscribing is once you subscribe, you can use, learn from the, uh, some of the people who have created their interiors and learn from them and create your own interiors. Thank you very much. My name is Ibrahim Mustafa. L subscribe, follow for more. If you have questions, if you also have strategies, uh, type them in the description below for others to learn. We are all learning, and maybe this may help someone. Thank you very much. Keep pushing, and never, ever, ever give up on your KDP dream. If it's not working, change your strategy. Thank you. My name is Ibrahim Mustafa, right from Ghana, West Africa. I believe in you.